Hey, today I wanted to figure out which pork skin was the best. So, these are Tom's pork skins, and these are the fried ones. So, let's try one now. That's pretty good. These are Tom Sport Skins. Oops, open two bags of the original. Hold on. I gotta buy my barbecue one. <laughs> no pork skins were hurt during the making of this video. <laughs> but this one, this is a barbecue Tom's pork skin. Mmm, it has a bold flavor. Mm. So I'd say the fried or the barbecue Tom's pretty good. Now, this one's Golden Flake. <coughs> this was the first one I bought. I got it from Walmart. And it, they're pretty good, but some of them, they got some hard pieces in there. So I was looking around to see if I could get some softer ones. Now the ones I just ate, the Toms, they're soft. I had any hard pieces in there. Now these were a little bit cheaper. These are Max. And they have um, fried and barbecue. Max brand, but they're... They're about like Golden Flake, a little bit cheaper. I think they were about five something for a container for those. And I believe it's about seven ounces. I know the other one's 7.5 ounces and it was like almost $8 for Golden Flake. Tom's is, they're $1.69 for, um, However many ounces in them things. I find it on the bag. Yeah, well, this is probably about the same. That's 2.375 ounces on the, uh, and the same thing for the barbecue. Now those, the Tom's pork skins, see, even that one. Mm-mm. Hear that crunch? I was eating some of these last night. I was talking to my mom, and I didn't realize how loud they were. <laughs> she just kept laughing. But I was hungry. You know, I was coming home. So she just kept laughing that she kept hearing that crunching. And something else would move around, and she'd hear that. And she was like, just dying laughing, you know. She said, you eat? And she said, if I did that, you would hang up the phone. But, you know, I quit for a few minutes. But these other ones, this is what the Max done ate them all. Well, some of them are in other containers. But these were the Max barbecue. And... It was five ounces in a bag. So they that's a pretty good price. And they ha even have uh, five ounces. Now, these were cheaper. These are the great value fried pork skins. And they, they're they not as good as the, the other ones, but they're, they're good for the price. But the best tasting, in my opinion, between Max, Golden Flake, Great value and Tom's. Now, Tom's are real bold. I don't like, I can't hardly eat pepper or anything, so I, I don't like anything hot. They got just a little bit, I wouldn't say heat, but just a, you can taste it. Um, try these one more time. Now, this is the fried Tom's. 
they're pretty good. And they're soft. You know. We even had a friend come over. And they ate some. And they even put some in their pocket. <laughs> of the other ones. So once they find these new ones, they might try to take the whole bag. They're that good. But they... They have a hard time chewing too, and I didn't realize they were missing some teeth also. So they they eat some of them, and um, they really like them. And uh, my wife's missing the teeth, so these are real good if you're missing teeth, and you like something that's you know a little crunchy and they're not too bad. Like um, it's loaded with sodium, so you'll probably drink lots of water, sweat, you know, and drive up your blood pressure. But um, you know, a whole bag here is five servings um, per container. So it's got 400 calories in a bag. And there's no sugars, no dietary fibers. Um, it's got nine grams of protein. You know, no cholesterol, 10 milligrams. You know, so, and sodium, 260 milligrams. And I don't think you... You don't want a lot of sodium. I'm not a nutritionist special, but I'm a specialist. But don't eat a lot of sodium. You know, it's probably not good for you. But yeah, I say these uh Toms. Hopefully, if anybody goes to the gas station, I got them at because they don't sell them in the store, the big grocery store that I went to. Um, somebody told me to go to another store like a Circle K that's in Aiken, South Carolina and they had two brands up there she might have been talking about Tom's but I went to a Sprint and you know Sprint has a good deal they have a thing called it's like a gas card but it's not a credit card but if you have a checking account you can tie it to your checking account and if the the gas right now, you know, everything's gonna go up. <clears throat> um, it's like two thirty five, and then or two twenty five, and then you get ten cent off. It might have been two thirty five, but you get ten cent off for using the card. But you got to transfer the money and make sure it's on there, and it takes a few days, you know, to come out. Yeah, the card. The card is called a Super Saver, and it's a Sprint. So you just put your, you got to go set it up. They they have the little paper that goes with it, and you set it up where it takes it out of your account, and you fund the card. And then when you use the card at the pump, you don't have to use your regular card. You just put that Super Saver card in there, and then ask you for your PIN, and then it gives you 10 cent off. But if you go in the store and buy anything, like um, different sprints have some cool stuff. You know, if, it's not maybe the best, but if you was in a hurry, they have like $1.99 biscuits, chicken biscuits, and they got snacks and um, cookies and all kind of stuff in there, you know, inside the gas station. So if you're in a hurry or, or you want to buy Tom's, you know, pork skins, <laughs> you buy the, you pay for it, you don't have to use your card, the uh, Super Savers card, but you use your other type of payment. You could use cash or a card, and then you just show it to the cashier, and they'll scan the back of it, and that accrues points. So like tonight, uh, I don't usually buy a lot of stuff in the gas station, but, you know, every little bit helps. So when you buy the the gas, you know, you get your five cent off, and then it asks you on the screen when you're outside, says, do you want to use your super savings uh, credit that you've used, earned? So I had like five cent. So instead of getting 10 cent off a gallon, I got 15 cent off a gallon for, you know, like thirty dollars worth of gas, so that adds up over time.
especially when I can't find my times. And it, it was another drink. You see my drinks, uh, sparkling water. They had the caffeine in them. Uh, sometime Walmart be at them, and they have them, so I can get earn points to get off and gas. You know, there's all kind of things. It's not a lot, but you know, when you want your toms, you want your port skins. It's nice to have a place to go get them. So out of Golden Flake, Max. Great value and Tom's, in my opinion, of my taste buds, Tom's is the best pork skins that I added those four as of February the 5th, 2021. You know, they're coming up with a vaccine. I'm coming up with which pork skin tastes the best. You know, so um, I just thought I'd share that. Hopefully we can go somewhere tomorrow. It's supposed to be raining. Might not. Might sleep in. Studying for my property and casualty license. I passed my life. But, you know, life's kind of hard. <laughs> life is hard. But life insurance is hard. Everybody needs it. But why do I need it? I can't afford it. But it's against the law to go without car insurance. You know, people need car insurance. And you got to have insurance on your house or, you know, you'll be considered self-insured or, by, or oh boy. You know, so it's worth having insurance, you know, flood insurance, homeowner's insurance, and automobile insurance. Especially if somebody hits you and you have to replace your car at least get to the same value you was at before the incident happened, you know. So wish me luck. See how that goes. But um, yeah, I just thought I'd share which port skin is the best. Where my little bag at? Tom's. Tom's port skin is the best. <laughs>